All right, let's see. Playing D'Angelo's level. Let's go to the base. It's got some bunkers, it looks like. I like how the fog disappears when you when you get there. Uh, there's a collectible. It doesn't come up in the inventory or have a value to it. It's no big deal. Okay, I saw E up at the top. Press E to open, press E to close. Okay. I played this through earlier. I made a video and it didn't save right. Um, and I didn't see that, but I see it now. Um, there should be a event thing that you can put on the doors and stuff that pops up in the middle of the screen like the lever. So I would look at maybe doing that. Um, I don't know what the floating um, thing right there is. It looks like it could be like a UI screen of some sort. I'm not quite sure. I like how these poles just kind of fall over. It makes me want to run through and just do it up to all of them. Um, okay, the hole in the floor, that's how you get through. Ah! I didn't see that earlier. Am I not close enough? Okay. Hey! Ah! Hey! Ah! Hey! Cool beans. Alright, I made it through there. Um. Right here, I saw this earlier, that when you hit E, it goes up, it works fine. But on your cylinders that you have, I would um, freeze their rotation. I think that would do it. If you freeze their rotation, that'll keep it from... Um, that'll keep it from falling over like that. Because you see how all of them are kind of... That one's instantly up and tilted, which that might be... Um, how you design that one that one's falling over and this one's acting weird and when i hit the lever it uh it doesn't work which this lever doesn't really work very well anyways because yeah it doesn't flop like that one over there does um but anyways yeah i would see about maybe freezing the rotation or something um Uh, you don't have collision on these big guys. No big deal. You just forgot. Um, I'm not quite sure what this lever goes to unless it opens a door on the other side. It doesn't. But um, the thing that stood out most in your level is your grenades. I really like how you... Uh, you got your grenades to function. They look really good. Their uh, their animation when they blow up is really nice. It's a um, very good job with the uh, with the grenades. Boom! Yeah, they're nice. And then um, here's something for the generator. that into place. You got all three. I think that is all you have done at the moment. Unless I walk up and press E. I don't think I do. But so far it's it's looking pretty solid man. I like um 
I like what you have in here so far. The hazard is nice to get through the gas chamber. The grenades are really well done. I really like your grenades. And then, you know, little uh, stuff like, uh, um, well, I shouldn't walk in that. Um, I don't know if it's intended or not, but I like that the pillars upstairs kind of domino when you run into them. That just gives me a little something to do while we're running through your level that I thought was fun. Uh, you have all your terrain. Um, yeah. For the most part, your interactions work. I did see where the doors told you to interact with it, where at first I didn't. It's up in the left. Just I would look at putting um, the Scraps Interactive script on there to, um, to get that press E to pop up in the middle of the screen and be easier to read than up in the top left where cache is. But other than that, man, it's... Well done. I like it. I'm excited to see where it goes in uh, PMP3. Alright, take it easy.